<laughs> Ellie sings! Ellie sings! Hello everybody, my name is Katja and welcome back to The Last of Us Tuesdays and welcome back to Miss Cat Squad. Guys, I didn't realize that Ellie, when you're standing next to her for a little while, she starts singing. Like, I just started recording this episode and all I hear is Remix time. Remix that for me. I would love to see some remixes of Ellie. Now, what we have to do is we have to go all the way to that building. And Tess is like, yep, there's our building. There is our building. And I'm all like, that's a, <laughs> that's a while to get there. But we gotta get some downtime. We gotta eat. We're hungry. We're thirsty. They probably are. And what Joel Baby, what he just went through. Imagine going through that. Like, take a moment. Alright? Take a moment and live like that. He got separated from his squad. And he had a fiend for himself. And in survival games, and also shows, books, whatever, movies, I watch a lot of survival shows, like <laughs> Total Drama Island, <laughs> yeah, but, se <laughs> but seriously, um, this game, what it does is it takes it, it makes it feel so real, because in real life, like, when you play certain other games, or you, like, read books or movies, sometimes they forget that you can get separated from your squad. And when you get separated from your squad and you have to feed for yourself, your, like, instincts kick in. And you're like, okay, what do I do? How do I survive this? And everybody, all of our Joels are different because you might just go all in and kill those clickers with the shivs. I, for one, just distracted one with a brick and ran for my freaking life. Just got out of the museum. Great field trip, as I was saying in the last gameplay. Let's continue and see where this leads us because I'm pretty sure we're going to run into a lot of enemies here. All right, girls. Oh, well, we're going to have to cross on this way. Stand back. Stand back, my queens. Where am I putting it? I'm gonna guess up there, but the boards are not used for climbing, cat. The boards are used for... Oh, there we go. I'm gonna guess. The boards are used for placing and, uh, crossing. Can I... There we go! Don't look down. Alright. Now watch your step as you're going yeah. up. It's just gonna be a little... <laughs> Angst! Boom! She knows what she's doing, Joel. She don't, she don't need any help. Na 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 na. Oh. Na na girl. So is that everything you hoped for? <laughs> Jury's still out. <laughs> Man. Can't deny that view. Come on, this way. Oh, oh God. Hey, let's pick it up. We're almost done. Stay focused. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Does not let him rest. Wow. Imagine me and Ellie never being able to see the outside. That's that's sad. <laughs> Where are we heading? It's right around this corner. Come on. All right. Let's keep moving, kid. Kid. Wait up, kid. Uh, uh. I'll let you go first. I want to go back up there and look at everything, but I'm going to see if there's anything that they want to say first. Tess! You know, I want to say something about that, what she said. Okay, so let me pause this for a second. I feel as if Tess is the one that brings him back to reality and brings him back where it's like, hey, stay focused. Hey, you can't be thinking like that at a time like this. This is survival. You need to start thinking just what is uh, what is the picture? What are we doing right now? Do not get off track. Because one time, if you ever get off track, and especially in a situation like this, you will lose yourself. You will also make all your other comrades lose themselves too. Because it's like, if, we, if no one is on the same track and no one's doing the same thing and going towards what we need to do, then everything gets messed up and we can never get where we want to be. So Tess is being that one that pulls him back to reality. Like he had that moment of calm with Ellie and they were just looking at the view and they, probably he was thinking like in his mind, I'm not sure what he was thinking at that moment, but he was probably thinking of his daughter and what he went through. And it's, it's sad to think that he can't have those moments, but Tess is right. Tess is basically saying you can't have those moments because we have to focus on what is going on. Get the big picture, let's move towards that, move towards that goal, and then think about that. Because again, if that shows weakness, and Joel is not weak at all, but seriously, even if he, he can even probably admit that he has weaknesses, and how he was just thinking and falling in love with the view and just thinking for that moment and resting for even just a second, that messes everything up. So 
that's why I think Tess was all like kind of mean as she was at that moment. It wasn't really mean, it was just putting him back on track. All right, girls, what are we looking for? Tess. Ellie, can I talk to you? What is she doing? Is she, is she throwing something on the ground? Is that blood? Is that blood? Uh, guys, there's blood, uh, there's blood on the floor. I don't think this is a good, good, this isn't good. Hold on, I'll be right back. I gotta go look up there. Let your ladies wait. Why is there blood on the ground? Hold on, girls. I know there's gonna be something up here. If anything, it'll be supplies, but I'm not sure. Hey, look! There's just trash! <laughs> Woo. No. Do -do -do -do. It's so easy to possibly get lost in this game, too, because there's so much to look at. What is that? Is that a plaque? I don't know, it's a vent. It was like, oh, this, this, this place was dedicated to- Oh, there's a ladder up there. Hmm. Alright, so I guess there's nothing up here. Fun to know. Do -do -do. Ladies! Uh, I was gonna do, like, a funny jump down there. Shiny was over here. Oh. oh! Hey, dude. Okay. Um, nostalgic. Hundred dollars. What is that? Firefly orders. What is that? Um, gonna read it. Orders. Patrol the rendezvous area. Ensure no military presence before moving to the moving the girl to the next safe house. Make sure the girl is well fed and in good health. Her safety is of the utmost importance. Okay, so I guess this was whoever it was that was supposed to take Ellie, but didn't and died. But wow, I guess everybody who tries to protect Ellie ends up dying. Great to know, but we have to, it says you have to keep her in good health and make sure she is fed. So we have to make sure Ellie is fed and in good health, which I have no problem of doing because I am Foster Mama Cat and I adopt these characters and I take care of these characters in which I will do for Ellie Baby. So anyway, let's go. Let's, let's get on here. Ellie. Hey, can I, can I talk to you? Oh, she's, what is she doing? Is she reading? No, she's picking something. Oh, is that her, is that her knife? Oh, that's her knife. That's her switchblade. Hey, Ellie got a nice switchblade there, huh? Oh, I'm probably gonna go that way. No. Okay. Sorry, girls. Probably this way. No, there's a spiky fence over there. Oh, there we go. These come in handy. Who knew garbage cans would come in handy? Alright, Joel. Use the dumpster to get over the gate. Oh, well, look at that. Tess, oh, ladies, 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 you are not trash, ladies. <laughs> Excuse me, ladies. All right, shaboom. There we go, that's where we want. All right, girls, we're heading this way. Jumpity jumps. I don't even have to wait for them. I trust them, shaboom. Tess, Ellie. There we go. There we go. Right. Home stretch, Tess. <laughs> Can I talk to you? You girls gonna talk? Um, just so it's out there, I can't swim. She can't swim. Look, it looks like it's shallow on the right side. Follow uh -huh. me. I'm glad Marlene hired you guys. Aww. What do you mean? I know you guys are getting paid for this, but. I'm trying to say things. Yeah, sure she likes us. She likes mommy and daddy. She's enjoying this field trip. I mean, they're good people, so. Where are we going? Is this a school? Right, you said get you guys said follow them and then we go and look at everything. Tess, I'm not going there yet. I'm not, I'm not going there. Can I talk to you? Can I, can I? No. Okay. How about you? Stay there. I'm gonna go patrol the area. No, 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 no. 
Wow. Take this moment, guys, okay? Look how beautiful this is. And I, I'm, a, I'm a big sucker when it comes to good graphics and also good lighting. And this game has both. This game is a freaking masterpiece. Like, can we just look at Joel right now? The, mo the moments I love most in this game is when the sun is out and it's shining because it's like, this is the downtime. This is a time where it's like you could take a breather as the gamer and take a breather as Joel and his gang and be all like, guys, look, look at that. That is beautiful. And I know you guys said in the PS4 version, which we will be playing later on in the future when I do a replay of this, you could actually take pictures. This is gorgeous. Like, Naughty Dog makes... Uh, it makes beautiful games, and also I'm going to be playing Uncharted, just so you guys know, because you guys, like, over 20 people have asked, are you going to play Uncharted? Yes, we are going to be playing Uncharted. All right, girls, you stay there. Daddy will be back. Daddy's home. All right. Oh, I wanted to say something about this before, but they were talking. All right, um, think about this, guys. This is swampy-ish type water, and in swampy-ish type water, you kind of get... Um, mosquitoes, <laughs> mosquitoes. You also get leeches. You get all these types of possible diseases. And I just want to appreciate this for a moment too, because when I was younger, I used to play a lot of Zelda games and never once has a game ever compared to the Twilight Princess, the Zelda game that I played. This game does. So right now I'm feeling like overwhelmed with feelings because the, the controls, everything how about it, it's like, it's bringing me back to those days when I was younger and I used to play games. And that was like one of the most happiest times of my life. And now to be able to do this and experience this with you guys on YouTube, like that's freaking a dream come true. Hey Taxi, gonna watch a Broadway play in New York? Like what's, what's the plan? What does it say? Poly... Poly... Contrast. Oh, I wonder what that is. Do -do -do. I'm taking a moment to swim. Ugh. Oh, just, and also, what doesn't help is it's green, so y you can honestly tell. There's dead fish. Like, what the? Ew. Oh. Oh, man. That's gross. That's, that's, that's not good. Blah. Alright. Alright. I know we came down this way, but. Dang. Oh. He's all like, okay, I need a shower after this. That's my question. How do they how do they bathe? Like, I mean, in this dystopian world, I'm not sure you get a lot of soap, so I mean I guess what they survive on what they can survive with. Can I can I go in there? It looks like there's something in there. The the stuff is barred off, so I'm sure nobody wants to go in there. Um, this looks like we're about to fight somebody. Um, I wonder if we're gonna come back here. Or do we have to run all the way back? Oh no, please don't tell me. Because whenever I see those things, I'm like, okay. Something's going on. Um. No. Cool. Do -do -do. Yeah, da -da. Taking a stroll. Oh, look at gorgeous! That is gorgeous! I mean, what part of, like... Like, what part are we in right now? Because we're in a city-ish type area. Dang. I wonder if the people who actually live in this area are like, um, now we got a, now we got a public pool for everyone to swim in. Nice. That's noise. That's really noise there. Uh, I'm just enjoying this, okay? I'm just enjoying running through this water, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Ew, the, uh, you, uh, the buzzy, the buzzy noises, the little, little fly guys. All right, wow. Oh, is that a? Well, that's that's a nice, that's a big swan. I mean, oh wow, hello, look at you. You're you're nice, you know. Great. Don't think I can go over here. No, it's blocking me off. Is it? Is it? A... No, it's not. Yes. Whole gameplay, Joel walking through the water. Oh man, this is actually really high. Oh wow. A horsey. Horsey guy. Oh, a picture of the military? I don't know. 
Look, look at these swans. Are this one of those boats that carry people around? Like, here's the tour. Here's a tour of our city. We are the best city alive. Every city says they're the best city, I swear. It's like, no. Why don't we all just be happy and just say every city is the best city for whoever lives there. Don't be like saying that you're you know, pretentious, you know, like, oh, we're better than you. I mean, if you ever go to New York, there's a lot of people like that. Like, oh, we're the best. And it's like, you know, you may say that because you just live there. But don't, like, exclude anybody else. Oh, even look at this. Even when he goes in the water, his clothes get wet. Wow. I am appreciating this. Like, like, oh, my God. Yes, Ellie, I'm coming. Daddy got his swim on. Daddy had to get- Daddy had to swim for a little bit. And to work up these muscles. Yeah. Hang on, girls. Gotta go over here now. Do -do. Are we in the building we're supposed to be at? Tess is like, come on. We're almost there. And she kept saying, be focused. Well, right now, I'm not focused. Alright. Time to go. Let's head on out, girls. No. What? No, no, no. What happens now? Oh, God. What are you doing, Tess? Oh, God. Maybe they, uh, maybe they had a map or uh, something to tell us where they were going. How far are we going to take this? As far this? as it needs to go. Oh, God, Tess. Where was this lab of theirs? Oh, she never said. She only mentioned that it was someplace out west. What are we doing here? This is not us. What do you know about us? About me. I know that you are smarter than this. Really? Guess what? We're shitty people, Joel. It's been that way for a long time. No, we are survivors. This is our chance. It is over, Tess! Ooh! Now, we tried. Let's just go home. I'm not... I'm not going anywhere. What? This is my last stop. What? What? Our luck had to run out sooner or later. Are you what? going on? No, don't! Don't touch me. What? Holy shit. She's infected. What? Joel. Let me see. I didn't mean for this. Show it to me. Oh, Christ. Oh. Oops, right? Give me your arm. This was three weeks. I was bitten an hour ago, and it's already worse. This is fucking real, Joel. You've got to get this girl to Tommy's. He used to run with this crew. He'll know where to go. No, 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 no. that was your crusade. I am not doing that. Yes, you are. Look, there's enough here that you have to feel some sort of obligation to me, so you get her to Tommy's. Oh, God, Tommy. They're here. Damn it. I can buy you some time, but you have to run. You want us to just leave you here? Yes. There is no way that- I will not turn into one of those things. Come on. Make this easy for me. Oh God, Tess, why? I can find No, no, just go! Just fucking go. Ellie. I'm sorry, I didn't I didn't mean for this. Get a move on. We know you're in there. Drop your weapons and come out with your hands up. What the fuck? I can't believe we did that. Stop. We just left her to die. Stop. You stay close to me. We have to move. Oh, man. She's sacrificing herself because she wants to protect Ellie. She wants to protect Joel. And she's going to fight for her death. Till her death. So she doesn't turn into one of them. Can we all just take this moment to really appreciate Tess for who she is? Can we take this moment to see how amazing of a character she is? She is, she is so much, it's not just pride, it's not being conceited when you, when you have this pride. 
She has this pride in herself where it's like she is she wants to die a human. She wants to die a hero. She wants to die and be and be remembered in some kind of way. And the reason she kept quiet to Joel and to Ellie was because she did she she did not want them to know like that that she didn't want them to panic. And if she told them that I'm infected, you do, you know darn well in that moment when Joel had his moment when he was just staring out in the, in the open, you would have known that she, she he would have freaked out and they would have gotten off track. And when she said, "This is my last stop," we know she's dead. We know she's dead. She's dead. <sighs> but you know. The reason I'm not getting extremely emotional about this is because she's she's literally sacrificing herself so they can get away. And not even and when Joel's like, I will fight with you. You know they had they had a thing. Those two had a thing. And when he's like, he's not crying, why isn't Joel crying? Because his heart is hardened enough. He's lost enough people as it is. And for him to not cry. That's, that shows a lot for his character. That, that really shows a lot for who he is because he's not the type to like be like me and just be like, oh my God. He's the type of character who's gonna go with it. And maybe one day it's gonna hit him. It's gonna hit him hard because they, they've been together for how long? And I hope that there's some kind of like flashback on how they met and everything because I love the relationship. But now here we go again. Now, if you want to think about this, I don't know what happened to Joel's wife with Sarah. In the beginning, you saw he was a single parent. He was a single father who was struggling with his job. Now, if you think about this, the parallel to that is now he has to take care of Ellie all by himself and deal with this job all by himself, struggle with the job all by himself. So that's kind of like a bit of a parallel to the, like the first scene, because again, Joel is always going to end up being alone. And it's sad to think that he's just going to be alone all the time, but he has Ellie. But yeah, I, I'm loving where this is going. I, I am seriously loving where this is going. Ellie, come here. We only have each other now. We only have each other. Can I go back in there? I won't remember you always. You have no idea, Tess. You have no idea. Whew. Okay. We'll go upstairs. We'll probably get out from there. Jeez. What? Okay. We gotta we gotta do this for tests. We gotta do this for tests. Oh my god. Come on. Just keep pushing forward. Alright. I know there's probably something over there though. I wanna look at that. Hold on, L, you stay there, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. Oh, you didn't stay. No, there's nothing there. All right, I was just double checking. Honestly, I think Tess just got shot. No, thank God I went back here. Supplies, supplies. Let's help. All right, let's go. We're booking it. We're booking it. We gotta do this for Tess. His heart. His. You have any idea how how broken his heart must be right now? I can just said we gotta keep going. Make it upstairs. Ellie, you ready? Let's go. She took out two of my men. Got it. You take out the door. You. Yes, sir. She took out two of his men. Oh my God, Tess! You fought till the end. These are humans. Oh my god. Oh my god. Tess. Oh god, Tess. Oh god, they're coming. They're coming. They're gonna be here soon. We 
should move. I gotta get supplies though first. Come on, Elle. Ellie? Okay. Oh. That was fucking close! Uh -huh. I don't know if they're still after us, but I got my supplies. Oh god, Tess. Did you hear the guy, though? She took out two of his men. And they are trained freaking military officials who literally have her coming in with freaking bazooka guns, if anything. Oh, who is that? Is that... Great. Is this sniper? Dang. Great. Good. Shotgun. Hunting. Hunt, hunting rifle. Okay. Am I gonna be shooting people? What do we do? I make every shot for Joel. I got this. No, you don't. Tess isn't here with you. I'll search out here. You, check down the hall. I love that guy's voice. Come on, show yourself. This is gonna be really hard. Okay, I want a brick. Good. We got this. We have a brick. I don't know. Oh god. Not that voice. What is that? Stay with me, come on. Alright, right, guys, we gotta keep quiet. I think I was just in here. Is that a guy? No, that's a lamp. You, go check down there. Keep your head down. God. Oh god, they saw me. That wasn't a good idea to do that right in the, out in the open. Okay, we're going this way. Go, come on. God, they saw me. They saw me. Coming, guys. Two of them are coming. You got me. Okay, I'll. Not safe. There's probably more. Is there anything I can take from you guys? 
No. No, there's not. I use my shift. Let me see if I can... Oh, fuck! 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 Alright. Alright, come on, Ellie. Right back. We good? Okay, let's craft something in the middle of this. Alright, good. Ah! I need binding. What is that crafting? Ooh. I remember they were talking about that. All right, Al. Oh, that's cool. Stay with me. Come on. All right. Did we get them all out? Let's go this way, Al. Whew. All right. That was fun. I like how it like switches from uh, you got the clickers and then you get the uh, you get these these guys. I like that. Going, Where are you, you mother? <laughs> oh, the outside. No, 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 no. I'm pretty sure there's gonna be more. Right. Oh, come on. It's okay. We're gonna get you to safety. Oh damn. Yes. Oh. Well, they're preparing me for something. Oh, don't mind if I do. Yay, we're going camping, Elle. Go on a camping trip. Do -do. Oh! Shoot, Nuggets. Well, we're gonna have to jump. Stay down, I don't know how many more there are. <gasps> we made a promise to test. We will make you go to safety. There's something shining over there. I really wish there was a map to this game. Oh. Great. That's really what I want. All right, I think this is like a downtime type thing. I don't know. Why is the music starting up? Oh, sh they're right there. I'm not, that is not downtime. They're fucking right there. Oh, sh they're literally right there. I oh my god. Oh. Okay, he's coming that way, so I want to sneak up on. <gasps> okay. No, it's clear. No target. That's a good boy. <laughs> Crazy. At least I got two, right? Watch out! Oh, Steven, get off of me! Why did I do that? Okay. He's right there. Oh god. Oh no, he's not. Well, no. <laughs> oh, we're stupid. Oh, where'd he go? Hello, mister. I know there's another. What you got? Let's see. You see anything? Shit. Nothing here either. Keep looking. Let's check over here. Hey, shit! Joel, there's the. <laughs> <laughs> Keep it 
Go, 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 go! go. We got it! We got it! Oh. God damn it! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! I can't get through! Well, I don't know if I'm supposed to go that way. Supplies. Supplies. Supplies! Ellie! Ellie! Oh, oh god. Oh shoot, spores. No target. I repeat, no target. There's a soldier over there. Hold your position and wait for reinforcements. Oh great. Copy that. How the hell are you breathing in this stuff? I wasn't lying to you. What? I know you weren't. Spot him? What? No. Place is empty. Search the area. Let's find them and get the hell out of here before any clickers show up. Oh, great. <gasps> well, there's a clicker. Maybe the clickers will come in handy for us. Where is this rat? Come, man. <laughs> All I have is my bat. All I have is my bat. All I have is my bat. Oh my god. Oh, there we go. Well, can we make it? I make it up there? I guess not. I'm gonna locate this server. Where is this rat? Okay. Let's just use it just because, like, I don't trust myself enough to not do that. Alright, oof. There may be supplies over here. Oh god, there's like... There's like the infected stuff is growing all over here. Great! That's just fabu. Is there any more app... Like, like, ooh. Oh jeez. I'm wondering if there's any more supplies. No. Ellie, you okay? I mean, huh? Wanna throw some health at me? <sighs> Great. Alright. Alright, we're boarding the train! Woo woo! There's gonna be clickers. And I don't have any shifts. Because I'm the idiot who used them. We're going this way first, and then we're gonna head back that way. Oh, what is that? No, that's not part of the train. We're gonna go to the back of the train. Because we're smart. Excuse me, girl. Back up, I said. Oh, oh. Where am I? Well, I want to look at the other stuff first. Okay. Being an idiot, I know, but I need to explore to see what this game has to offer. There's gonna be clickers, I know it. No doubt about that, there's going to be clickers. Uh, uh, there's, there's a way out. Oh, the beautiful sunlight. Yeah, I even have time to give Tess a burial, a proper burial, like, ugh. Guess we're going back to the other part? Yeah. Can I get up there? I do. I hear little froggers. Nice, nice, uh, nice frog sound effects. <laughs> I have no idea where I am going. 
Oh, there's water. Just keep going straight. One in doubt. I can't swim. We'll figure something out. Oh, God. All right, guys. So next time we go on to this adventure, we are going to be getting out of this place. Tess was, again, I loved her character. I really, really did love Tess's character. And to be able to lose her, it's sad. But the way I did lose her, it was such a good way. It fit her character so well that I'm happy the way it happened. I'm not happy that she died, but I'm happy that the way she did go out was very honorable. But anyway, guys, we're going to be continuing The Last of Us, I promise you guys, but I, I love where this is going, and I, I, for one, all I do know is that I'm getting a little better at the controls, so that's good for that, but there's gonna be more of The Last of Us, I promise, every single week there's gonna be two uploads, it's The Last of Us Tuesdays, and just so you guys know, I will be making a video to support Tess, and how great her character development was, and how great of a person she was to not only Joel, but Ellie, and to the series. She made a big impact to the series. Anyway, guys, I hope you have an amazing day. Stay safe, and as always, Miss Cats, until the next video, embrace your inner fangirl, and your inner fanboy, every single day.